Case IH Magnum Autonomous. It's in disguise. What's going on everybody? DJ Coham here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to new mods for Farming Simulator 19. Today I've got 17 mods for you and they are all downloadable on all platforms. And with those, we have 8 new and 9 updates. Let's check them out. First up today we have the Kvernland Hay Fork by North Mining Company. The Hay Fork is for tractors and was developed by local farmers in the beginning of the 1950s and manufactured under the license Kvernland. This Hay Fork fits perfectly behind the Ferguson TA or TEA 20 after you've harvested your field, get your tractor with the Kvernland Hay Fork attached and start to pick up the hay, straw, or grass. You can also pick up manure and chaff with it as well, which is super cool. Plus silage. This thing's awesome. So this this goes on the back of your Ferguson tractors from the Ferguson pack by North Mining Company, and you can change this to any color that you would like. Whatever you like, go for it. This thing is awesome. Your next new mods for all platforms today is going to be the Rao Unisim MS4 and MS6. These can be both found in planters, and they're going to be near the very end, so you may as well just go straight to the end when you get these. The MS4 is going to be $2,500, needs 50 horsepower to be powered, will hold 1,510 liters of gra or, uh, not grass and silage. What am I talking about? Seeds and fertilizer. It's going to plant all your normal planter crops. And then your Unisim MS6, this is going to hold 1,660 liters of seeds of fertilizer require 60 horsepower uh, 4.5 meters and 3 meters respectively both at 7 miles per hour now in here we have customization options we have without signage and with signage so there you go uh, not a whole lot going on with that let's see what's ah with signs without hose and what's the okay that's pretty cool that's pretty interesting so i'm not really sure where the hose goes I think I may go up to the front. And uh, regardless from there, then we have capacity. We have standard, which only holds 510 liters. That's only going to be seed. Then you can add fertilizer tanks on there as well. That is going to be solid fertilizer, not liquid fertilizer. And then the exact same thing here as well um, is going to increase by 1,000 liters. Very cool there. Hey, I like these. These are pretty neat. Price is pretty decent as well. $2,500 and $3,500 for planters. That's great. Next new mod is the Lizard Bell Trailer. This bell trailer is very handy trailer. It's going to hold six bells suitable for smaller tractors and for playing on smaller maps. This is going to cost you $1,200 and we can change up the main color. We do get a base color red, which looks very similar to either Case or Massey. I'm not really sure which one it is. They're so similar anyway, uh, but you could change it up to whatever color you would like. One thing to keep in mind is that those wheels are not going to change at all and your design color is going to cost you a hundred bucks. So just keep Keep that in mind but very cool very cool this also has straps you could strap those bales down the next mod today might be one of the cooler things i've ever seen this is the box refill trailer or online says the box truck trailer this right here is a closed box trailer that has the capacity to haul seeds fertilizer herbicide and a few other things as well so of course not going to open or anything like that but it will hold things. So the price is going to be $15,000. Capacity is 4,000 liters. We got some really sweet rims on there. Colors, every single color in the game, whatever you would like. Now here's the cool part. So this is going to hold seed, solid fertilizer, herbicide, liquid fertilizer, pig food, lime, oats. It will also hold wheat and it will hold water. What? <laughs> That's awesome. That's super cool. This is going to be extremely helpful around some smaller farms, uh, maybe even some, some medium-sized farms that you got going on. Refill your sprayers, refill your pigs, all that stuff. This is the trailer for that. And that's so cool. We've got a new bell spike pack. This is a front loader tool pack designed for straw recovery and hay harvesting, as well as transport and stacking. In the pack, we have the Sapphire Bell Spike FL. It's going to be 458 bucks. Lizard Bell Spike TL is going to be 900 bucks. And the Duvel's Door Bell and Spiken uh, FL. Sorry, I totally butchered that. For 780 bucks. Real cool pack here. Next up, we have the Lizard MKS 16. This is going to hold all your liquid crops. Or, liquid crops. It's basically going to hold milk, water, slurry, and digestate. So it's going to hold those four right there. No uh, fertilizers or anything like that. Main color, we have chrome, stainless steel. We also have black, which looks really good. And then we go into our normal in-game colors. They have made this to where they're going to be flat colors, so they're going to be pretty normal. They're not going to be some wild and crazy chrome version that nobody wants. So you could have all that stuff right there. We're going to change that back to chrome. 
design we have standard and we have ladder that's going to add a ladder here on the top we also have design down here standard or collision avoidance so you can add a little little bit down there on the bottom plus wheel setups we have standard which are nokian you get narrow tires which are lizard tire and then you get your wide tires which of course is a good looking t404 right there i love those uh if you do everything so if you change up every single thing it's gonna cost you an extra 3150 bucks bring your grand total to forty two thousand four hundred dollars your next to last new mod today for all platforms is gonna be the farmhouse it's a farmhouse sleeping option for tired employees price is forty five thousand dollars daily upkeep 20 bucks and it is seasons ready which is extremely important nowadays with placeables this guy right here is just a house Go up to it. Tired? Nope. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. <laughs> and you can find it in placeables. As far as a look around, you can't go inside, though the outside does look very, very good. Got some worn textures here on the house. Really, really like that. Going around, looking good, looking good. Nice air conditioner unit right there. And all the way back around to the front again. It looks lived in. I like it. It's, it's cool. So there's some people that like having a house they can go in. There's some people that don't. Um, and for me, particularly... As a mod, I prefer to be able to go in, but as a play style, I don't like to go in. It's there for one reason, let me go to bed. That's about it. And your last new mod for all platforms today is going to be the Shed Spanish with Workshop, aka the Spanish Shed with Workshop. This right here is a typical Spanish Shed placeable with workshop animation, lighting, and decorations. It is seasons ready. Price is only $7,500 and daily upkeep is 5 bucks per day, which is pretty darn good if you ask me. Now you may be saying to yourself, DJ, this looks very familiar. Yep, because we have a green and white version without the workshop trigger inside so let's jump in and let's check it out let's open the doors and we're gonna go right in and this is where your workshop is so do you think boom customize all good Boo, whip. and that's it it's uh pretty much like the other stuff go here turn your lights on lights look good do they have an animation to them hey i love that and then when you're done come on back out oh man i tried to do don't know and when you're all done come back whatever moving into mod updates for all platforms today first we have the fella grassland equipment pack changelog 1.0.1 for the 3060 we've added a new store pick and fix the connection hoses for the 3670 we fix the store size and fix the decals for the 8608 on the left hand side right here we fix the decals and for the 1502 right here, they fix the wheel size. We've got an update to the Fellagers 14055 Pro. Change log 1.0.1. Remove the daily upkeep. Added new colors. Added new brand logo. And added a new store pick. Now, unfortunately, I'm looking at this and I am not able to actually customize it. So I'm assuming that these new things were just added without a customization option. And an update to the Case IH Autonomous Tractor Robot in Disguise. Changelog 1.1, minor 3D fixes, and texture corrections. Love this thing. We've got an update to the Joyce DX Agristar 461471. This guy right here has got an update 1.0.11 texture update. And an update to the Lizard ZB14 trailer. Changelog 1.1 wheel configuration has been added. Also, new color configurations have been added. Minor visual errors have been corrected. Modification name changed. And wheel hubs have been changed. So, let's take a look at those. Main color, we've got gray. We also have white. And we have... Oh, I was on a rim color. <laughs> and rim color, we have... Grip. There's, there's differences. Yep, there's different brown woods as well yep design yes or no and then wheel setup you've got a small let's see one which got different wheels in the front and the back two which brings both wheels the same and three which brings well, both wheels the same again there you go there's your update to the zb14 an update to the lizard grubber 2.5 m changelog 1.1 fix lowering fix the model and added collision we have an update to the summer sheep pasture changelog 1.001 change the season's mask area and change the description version we've got an update to montana changelog 1.001 sleeping point has been added and animal loading trigger dealer has been added and an update to no man's land changelog version 1.1 fixed a few floating trees and added over 50 placeable items. Well, guys, that is going to be it for today. I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, make sure you drop a like on the video, get subscribed to the channel, join to go ham fam. Make sure you turn your notification bells on as well so that you never miss daily farming simulator videos here on the channel. With all being said, I hope you have a great day. We will see you later. Peace.